Who's up for a drink? I know I am. Welcome back to our coffee adventure with the Barissimo Coffee Advent Calendar 2023. How you doing? Hey, what day is today? Mike, 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 what day is it? It's day 20? Yes, Wednesday, day 20. And today, on day 20, we have roasted chestnut. Uh, I don't think I've ever had a roasted chestnut. Um, I don't even know what a roasted chestnut tastes like. I don't even know what an unroasted chestnut tastes like. Do you? Who eats roasted chestnuts? All right. Uh, well, let's see what we can, we can figure out. And, and I know I was going to say I was going to use my Alice in Wonderland mug, but I forgot to run the dishwasher. So... Uh, I'm going this other one where it also has a lot of a lot of headspace to hopefully the aromatics can can get more well funneled. I make up words all the time and meanings and just play along with me, make me feel good about myself. Thanks. Hmm. I can smell something. <laughs> Something a little bit beyond the traditional coffee smell. Um, it is, it is a little bit of of a nuttiness there. It's really on. I'm really getting the aroma when. You're breathing in, taking a deep breath, and it's that that last little bit of that breath where you're like struggling to keep breathing in. You're like, you know, that tail end. That that's where I'm, I'm getting the aroma. Huh. Not unpleasant. I mean, at this point, being not not finding faults is a good thing. You know, I can be a little bit nitpicky on my coffee, but if I can't find a fault, that means it's a pretty good coffee. All right, enough sniffing. Let's get to sipping. All right, uh, right up front, it has a little bit of a a waxy. Not sure if it's a taste or a feel. Um, and it's also pretty steaming hot. I thought I waited longer than yesterday. All right. It's it's a very light coffee. It's not as thin as yesterday. Um, a little bit smoother. It's still light but smooth. I'm, I'm really looking for any, okay, on the finish, I would say that's where I'm getting a different flavor. Um, what I was just about to say before I interrupted myself was that I'm really hunting for something that doesn't taste like coffee. Um, and the finish, it has a non-traditional coffee flavor on the finish. So I'm going with that's the chestnut, the roasted chestnut. Yeah, so it's after you sip and after you swallow and then you just, that lingering nuttiness is, is the best I can, I can describe it. Yeah. Um, yeah, see, it's it's right when I'm about to say something that the aftertaste really becomes more pronounced. Probably because I'm inhaling right before I speak. Um, that's really what's giving me that extra boost of flavor on the finish. And 
yeah, and the more I'm drinking it, the more I'm getting that nuttiness. Whether the flavoring that they use is is coating more in my mouth, which is letting more receptors get a hold of it to really start piecing it together. Um, yeah, it's 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 a, it's an okay cop, a cup of coffee. Would I be able to tell you it's roasted hazelnut or roasted chestnut? Hazelnut, I'd be able to know. Roasted chestnut? No. I could not tell you what this flavor is. But if you're like, hey, here's a cup of coffee, and I go, eh, it's pretty good coffee. You know? Um, all right. Well, hey, it's uh, Wednesday. That means it's all downhill from here. Um, oh, and last Wednesday... Uh, drop a comment or a thumbs up or something if you saw how my uh, video ended last Wednesday after the little closer. Um, I just threw that in for you guys. See if anyone picked up on it. See how long you're watching. You should be watching the whole thing. Or are these too long? Let me know. All right, yeah. Um, nothing earth shattering. Good cup of coffee. I say, like I said, I can't claim. Oh, this is I can taste the flavoring. I just can't. Um, knowing the flavor, I'm trying to nitpick and delve into it to try to extrapolate flavors. And since I, you know, and it totally tastes like roasted chestnut, but I've never had roasted chestnut, so I I can't. I don't have any of those sensory points to pinpoint and go, oh yeah, that's that flavor. Um, so. I'm definitely getting something on the finish. So it, it's a lingering finish, which is that little like waxy, nutty kind of thing. Um, so, yeah, it is what it is. All right. Until tomorrow. Cheers. What's in your mug?